But yeah, I didn't see this one coming, man. I didn't think it was such a big deal in that respect. But I guess, again, maybe that's why these guys earned the big bucks. And here we are talking about things on the interwebs. <laughs> um, so yeah, so this is an article from TechCrunch. It says Uber Eats, um, Uber Eats, Uber Eats embedding it into the main app. Uh, I like that play on words. It said there, right? So it, it following, let's read this article here from TechCrunch. Um, Uber's best hope to beat all ride sharing and food delivery competitors is that it does both. Um, through one cross promotion, it can continue activities. It can combine activities uh, people might only do a few times per week or month into one product they open daily. Uber CEO Dara something said crypt- crypt- cryptically on the company's first earnings call last month that suffice it to say we are starting to experiment in ways in which we can upsell our ride customers to Uber Eats deals in, in a way that, you know, to be plain spoken isn't annoying. I will tell you that we are very, very, very early stages of exploring the many ways in which we, our rider business can help continue to build our Uber Eats business and vice versa. I wonder what they mean by that. Does that mean you can order the, um, from deliveries from restaurants further away than what you are if someone has a car that you don't mind waiting for a little bit longer? I wonder what that is. I don't want to give away too much. Okay, that's pretty cool, isn't it? So, um, but TechCrunch has discovered that specifically Uber is starting to make a web view of Uber Eats accessible from its main app. A tipster in Boston first clued us into the feature. Now, and now Uber confirms that it's merging a fully functional web version of Uber Eats into its ride hailing product. Uber quietly began rolling out a pilot of the merged app in a late April. That's interesting because I've used, um, I'm not sure about you guys, when I'm, when I'm at home and I want to order an Uber Eats, I tend to use my laptop. If I'm using my laptop, I don't tend to use my phone unless I'm out. So, um, yeah, I'll just use my laptop to ride the movies and it kind of tracks it same sort of way. You kind of get all the big pictures, you get all the big pictures on there. Um, the only thing I'm not a fan of them is maybe the descriptions of the dishes are not quite clear sometimes. It's just broken down in terms of ingredients, not about, I don't know how it's cooked and stuff, maybe a bit more descriptive. Maybe they could introduce some like um, gifts of how it looks on the plate and it getting prepped, maybe some video of it or something like that, of it being put together. Imagine like a burger being put together with the sauce and stuff, lettuce, condiments, all that sort of malarkey, the meat, and put I mean, that might make it a bit more tantalizing. I don't know. That's interesting. Um, Uber, Uber Eats app will remain available as a standalone app. Uh, the move could give Uber customers acquisition and retention edge on single product competitors like Lyft and DoorDash while helping to keep up with product um, multi-product peers like Khmer and Bolt which recently added food delivery and its biggest global foe Didi from China okay cool this is all globally I think in Europe or in the UK for the most part they've got no real competition DoorDash Just Eat even Deliveroo are kind of way 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 behind um, Uber Eats in that right now like you, you definitely see more Uber Eats uh, couriers and drivers around than you would do a Deliveroo person even um but uh, but Didi in, in in China, which has launched full delivery in Uber stronghold Mexico. Okay, cool. That makes sense because when I was in Mexico City, that we use Uber completely. Um, combining functionality means Uber's uh, ride hailing customers could see a promotion for Uber Eats and instantly try it without downloading a new app as their um as their tummy rumbles. It could also get fifty percent of Uber Eats customers to ride the ride. Okay, really? So there's a lot of people that use Uber Eats and don't use Uber. I didn't know that. Interesting. Okay, uh, we're rolling out a very new way to order eats directly in the Uber app on Android. Um, an Uber spokesman tells me the cross promotion gives riders who are new to eats an seamless way to order a meal via a web view instead of opening up an apps on the download. The merged app is now available on all iOS users in all cities where Uber doesn't offer bikes and scooters that already cluster the interface of its car app service such as SF, um, LA and New York City. The Android version is out is out to the 17% of users in, the, uh, in Uber Eats and 500 markets uh, uh, with the goal of cross-promotion tool being available to all riders. And the spokesperson says, we believe our platform model allows us to acquire, engage and retain customers with the cost as well as um, uh, efficiency and effectiveness advantage of our rivals. Typically, uh, Manoline uh, cost competitors, we have found that we we what we found is that with uh, rides and eats we are seeing early signal where essentially you can have very little if any cannibalization of a ride and throw a significant amount of potential demand into the eat side okay i never knew this was a thing i never knew that people were just using uber eats um i mean uber eats app 
as a standalone app instead of actually using Uber. Because that's how I discovered Uber Eats, right? I wouldn't have discovered it without using Uber. Um, they've kind of both are things I use quite often. Uber, of course, you know, you're running home late, especially after my DJ gigs. You don't want to get a bus. You don't want to walk to a fucking train station. You just get an Uber and just jump home, especially the times that I finish aren't usually the peak times around what? after one or up before 11 so or after one or just before 12 so you can kind of really get a cheap ride there and yeah let me just see how that goes on globally how that deals with it but yeah they're trying to merging it now at the moment you can see where that's where this develops uber eats merging with uber interesting to see